Hi, I'm Gritaj Sandhu. And I'm Rob Williams. We are here to talk about BlackBerry Identity Service. Ah, uh, remembering passwords. What a pain. You almost need a full-time assistant. Unless you use BlackBerry Identity Service, with it you just launch your app and it automatically logs your users using BlackBerry ID. BlackBerry Identity Service is a standardized interface for accessing identifiable information about the user across multiple identity providers or IDPs. Supported identity providers effectively make it possible for developers to pull out data about a user from multiple registered sources based, of course, on the consent of the user. Over time, this service will support multiple identity providers, the first of which that are supported today are BlackBerry ID and BlackBerry Profile. In the current release of the Identity Service API, you will still be required to maintain some user information. The service will provide you with a persistent identifier for the user. Additional features such as third-party federation and authorization will be added in future releases of the platform. One of the great things about this service is that it frees your users from having to remember yet another login profile. And, and if it fits your needs, it could save you from having to build user authentication into your app. Remember, users of your application have probably already signed in to BlackBerry ID on their device, so your application already knows who they are. BlackBerry ID is an identity service that gives customers convenient access to multiple BlackBerry products, services, and applications using the one login. With BlackBerry ID, you're using built-in device authentication to authenticate with your backend. All you have to do is link your existing authentication system with BlackBerry Identity Service and use BlackBerry ID to authenticate to identify user. This would require third-party application to consume the UID that BlackBerry ID provides and map it to your existing account system. With the BlackBerry ID Identity Provider, you can now automatically sign users into your app after they sign in with the BlackBerry ID account on their devices. This makes your app much easier to use. Making your application as simple and easy to use is key to your success. If the user is authenticated, you can access their first name, last name, screen name, and user email address. This gives you instant personalization as soon as your user launches your application. Here you can view the flow diagram in using BlackBerry Identity Service to access personally identifiable information with BlackBerry ID provider. First, your application integrates with the IDS library and registers with the BlackBerry ID provider. Then you would issue a request to get user properties, allowing you to retrieve several pieces of user information. You'd also issue a request for the UID using get user properties, allowing you to retrieve the unique identifier for the user. You can also issue a challenge request to force the user to authenticate with their credentials, verifying their identity. In the event that the user has not yet authenticated with the system, a request to any of the above APIs would in turn trigger an account creation or login flow. The second identity provider that we support is BlackBerry Profile. This enables developers to provide off-device secure encrypted storage authenticated via BlackBerry ID. This is not a massive cloud storage solution. This is for smaller amounts of profile information. This also allows the same app installed on multiple devices to access that same information. It also allows apps written by the same vendor to sync and share some vendor-specific data associated with the user. When using BlackBerry Profile Provider, the user would need to be authenticated with BlackBerry ID. So here are the steps that it takes to use BlackBerry Profile Identity Provider. Your application integrates with the IDS library and registers with the BlackBerry Profile Provider. You then issue requests to the CRUD data APIs to create, update, retrieve, delete user-specific profile information your apps may have stored. And you can store data at the application or vendor level, allowing access to just your particular app or a collection of apps written by your organization. Just to summarize what we shared, BlackBerry ID Provider gives you user information and BlackBerry Profile Provider gives you access to storage. Currently, there are only two, but over time, this service will support multiple identity providers. Additional features, such as third-party federation and authorization, will be added in future releases of the platform. Now, Cascades developers, you can see the API right now, and shortly, we'll have a sample posted in the BlackBerry GitHub. Don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel, and if you think we are missing anything in our documentation or sample, or if you found this particularly useful, send us a tweet. Thank you for watching. Thank you.